Dear Recruiter, Did you know that Nokri has launched a bundle of new features in RESTEX that will change the way you work on resumes and would make the process of follow-ups less time-consuming and very efficient? Well, these new features added under the module of requirement you're hiring for will let you add application and call statuses, reminder settings to help you in easy follow-ups, and a ready online Excel tracker of shortlisted candidates for your future reference. Through this video series, we will understand all these features in detail. To get started, I have already logged into an employer's account and now let's go to RESTEX and click on search resumes. After that, this page opens up of requirement you are hiring for. Add the name of the position you are working upon as per your convenience, for example, Solution Architect Bangalore or Interior Designer as giving a name here would have no effect on your search results. And after that, click on continue. This will redirect you to the advanced search page. Here, enter the criteria the way you have been entering and perform a search. Further, go through the resumes on the result page and click on the shortlisted CV. You can see that several new features have been added on the top here. Now, conventionally, after shortlisting a candidate, we will like to call a candidate. Supposedly, you call this candidate and he has asked you to call sometime later. So, instead of making a note on your notepad or a manual Excel tracker, click here and put the candidate under the status of calling later. As soon as you will click on call later, a window will pop up here to set a reminder to call this candidate sometime later. Let's suppose I'll click on set custom time. Add the time here. If you would want, Nokri will also be notifying you at your registered email ID through here. And after that, click on set reminder to complete the process. For any set reminder, the notification will be appearing like this. You can reschedule the task by clicking on the snooze button or complete it, finish it and get over with it. Further to this, after calling the candidate, if the candidate is interested in asking for the JD, we can assign an application status to the candidate. There are several commonly used statuses like promising, interested, interview schedule, etc. available here. In this case, we can mark this candidate on interested as a status and another task window will pop up where Nokri is suggesting me to send the JD to this candidate. You can do that right away or set a reminder to do it later in the similar way as we have learned some time back. So this is how you can create a pipeline of the candidates in Nokri itself. The best part about these application statuses and call statuses is that you can filter out the candidates profiles basis these statuses anytime later in the future. We would be talking about the same in our upcoming videos. In the next video, we will learn how to customize an application status of your own choice. And second, how to share a CV with a colleague or a senior and assign a task to the same. And that is all about it. If you have doubts or any suggestions regarding to our videos, please email us at support at the rate Do like and share this video and subscribe to our channel by clicking on the button appearing on your screen. Thank you.